Hey guys, it's O Tom here, and welcome back to SCP Containment Breach. Now, in the last episode, I gave everyone the option to vote in the comments whether I should use my magic powers to uh, spawn in a key card and see what was behind that door, or whether I should just go down in the tunnels and carry on looking for the key card properly. And a lot of people said they wanted to see what was behind the door, so we are going to go see what is behind the door. Shut up, duck. No one cares. Okay, right, we're going to see what's behind this door. So let me just shut this door in case bad things happen. Like they do in this game. Right, so. We will drop this. <laughs> and spawn item. Level 5 key. Key card. Crap, spawn item. Level 5 key. There we go, right. Super magic powers. Right, let's see what's behind the store. I was right, it's just the nukes. Okay, this is good because. Okay, that was loud. Um, yeah, this is good because now we can turn these off so that we don't get blown up at the end of the game. Uh, I'm going to save it just before in case it bugs out because I'm not really sure if these are fixed yet. <sighs> so yeah, thanks to everyone that voted on what they wanted me to do. So now you know, I was right. It is the warhead silos thing. Is there a guy in there? Because there is sometimes. I don't want to go in and get shot. It's a bulletproof vest. We, we definitely need that. Fuck! These loud noises, man. Right, um... Yeah, the two things... That, uh, killed us... One sec. Got a really itchy nose. Ugh. Yeah, the two things that got me killed in the last save, where I was, like, near the end of the game... Now, can't really get me killed, because... I got dragged into the pocket dimension by Radical Larry after being shot. And now I've got a bulletproof vest and Radical Larry's contained. So if I've got a bulletproof vest and Radical Larry is contained, then, well, nothing... Well, I'll still die, probably. I'm not going to lie. But at least the way I died last time isn't really possible now. Getting shot will still do damage, but not as much. And... SCP-106 or Radical Larry, whatever you want to call him, obviously he isn't about anymore, so he can't get me. Right, game saved. Good, right. We now have a bulletproof vest, which is obviously a good thing to have at this point in the game, because at this point, there's usually a few soldiers about. Uh, I am walking slightly slower with the bulletproof vest, but that's fine. There's not really any reason to walk fast in this game, is there? To be perfectly honest, I wish I could just guess this key code, but... Because then I could just go through instead of going underground and getting up. So if the door's there, that means I probably don't have to go far to get to the lift. <sighs> oh, I hate tunnels. Right, safe, because I don't know what's going to happen. I think these are the tunnels with the witch doctor guy. Holy shit. These tunnels make me so on edge. I hate these tunnels. Oh, crap. That's the elevator. Oh, dead bodies and stuff. That's the lift. I just got to wait for it to open. It's not opening. Oh, God. We can do this. No, wait. No, this is the lift. I don't know what the other thing was in. Shut up, mask guy. I'm not helping you. You're going to die. Okay, you're going to be stuck here. You're going to be contained. You're going to die. Let's go. Let's get out. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Obviously, because I've played this game quite a lot, I know that the witch doctor guy doesn't spawn unless you actually go in the room with him. So, that's good that he didn't, you know, that I didn't go in the room and he didn't spawn. Okay, we are at a different place. Let's save the game. Right, we need to find the electric. That's the main thing that we are, you know, trying to find at the minute. Uh, put these batteries in that. Now I can pick this up. Where is this? Bloodstained note. 
God in heaven, I think the wall cracked on the floor. Blah, 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 I don't care. <laughs> okay, this is the cowbell, I believe. Yep, not going to pick that up because that will just make things a lot worse than they need to be. Okay, something is crawling on my leg. <laughs> uh. Oh, close the door, I'm going to blink. There we go, right. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Right, we just need to find the electricity, get back to the computer, and then come back to the electricity. Wait, close the door. Uh, yeah, turn the electricity off, go to the computer, computer will be like, yep, yeah, turn it back on. So I need, then I need to come back, turn it on, and then we'll be able to get out. Well, that's the that's the plan anyway. Whether or not that's going to happen is a different story. Completely. But, uh Oh, I hate hay fever, man. It makes everything itchy. Right, I just went in a massive circle, so... It's not great. So, yeah, a bit of a back and forth part of the game here. Electric, computer, electric, exit. That's that's is what we're going for right now. So, like, last time we went that way. Let's blink. Open the door. Oh, shit. Right, okay. Get ready for this. Oh, he's not there. I'm going to run backwards anyway, because I don't trust this game. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Oh, great. Just where I wanted to be. Okay. Okay, that one open. Why? Oh. Okay. <gasps> oh shit. Okay. Okay. Just chill. It's okay. We're fine. Just chill. Right. Swap it over to the generator. Just chill out. We're fine. Fuel pump on, generator on. Now we can leave. <sighs> we did it. Whew, okay. That was horrible. I never want to do that ever again. But I probably will have to because I'm probably going to get like right to the end of the game and then die. Oh crap! Blink. Gas mask. I've got these strategies down. Save game before I turn around in case something's in my face. Uh, okay. Uh, these rooms could be risky sometimes because obviously it's where 106 can spawn, but it's not a problem anymore. So, right, this is where 173 gave me that big jump scare last time, so I'm ready for that. Uh, now, sometimes you have to go this way, sometimes you don't. Hopefully, this can be one of them times where the electric room will be on the other side of this. Like hopefully, you know, the world spawn has gone in my favour. Really hope so. Okay, right, let's close that. We don't need to go in there. Oh, that was me. Yeah. Oh my girl, okay. Didn't know my character was a girl. Right, let's have a look over here. What's right, that's a key code for to get in there. Maybe there is something good there. I don't know, we'll go this way. <sighs> okay, getting nervous now, because I haven't seen 173 in a while. I feel like he's going to be right around the corner somewhere. Okay. I don't like this. I'm just like going in. I don't even know. Have I been here or are these just open? I don't know. Where am I? <laughs> I'm lost. Um, 
Ooh, zombie virus. Alright, we don't want none of that. Wait, yes, wait, 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 open the door, open the door. Now I think there's good stuff in this room. Really? Okay. I'm gonna get the suit, but that's it. I'm not gonna go in there. If you go in the room, <laughs> oh shit! If you go in the room, um, you get turned into a zombie. Like not straight away, but over time. I'm um, and also one seven three was in that room. I don't know if anyone else saw that. But yeah, one seven three was just casually standing in that room. Like I don't know, maybe trying to be a zombie, I suppose. Um, let's go this way. God, this is like turning into a massive maze. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna point out right now. If I find the electric room, there is no way I'm gonna be able to find my way back to the computer. I'm just gonna be 100% lost. I don't feel like I'm ever gonna get back to that computer room. Like I feel, I think I'm just gonna be stuck in this bit for ages, to be honest. Or not. We just got to the entrance zone. Okay, I'm gonna save it. How long have we been recording? 11 minutes 30 seconds that is I literally I've got like an internal clock for 11 minutes 30 seconds I always check at around that time right we've got to the entrance zone this is really really good we're here again the only bad thing is um, once you get to the entrance zone that's usually when the soldiers come into it and start sh oh shit that's usually when the soldiers come into it and start shooting you and then you start dying, but I have a bulletproof vest because I'm just like, you know, some kind of action hero right now. Right, this is a dead end. The soldiers have been. Oh, yeah, look, here we go. They're in the. They're here. I need to try and avoid them now. That's the only. That's the hard part. <gasps> I found the electric room. Safe. Oh, <laughs> we found the electric room, but you know now we've actually got to get back to the computer and then back here, and that's probably never going to happen. So bad luck, but but yeah, I think the electric room only spawns in the entrance zone. So okay, remove door control. Off. Oh. Right, if I remember rightly... Oh crap, okay, well that just broke. That's bad, um... Okay, well... The game... Um... Yeah, it... Every time I load it, it's coming up memory access violations, so we found the electric room, but now the game's... May have permanently crashed, which is bad, but... Hopefully it'll get fixed, but anyway, yeah, so I'm gonna leave it there for today. We've made good progress, um, we've found the electric room... All we have to do is turn off door controls so that the computer can't shut the door in our face. When we go back to him, we'll talk to him. He'll say, please turn on door controls, blah, blah, and then he'll open the exit. So turn off door control, talk to the computer, come back, turn the door control back on, and then he'll open the exit and we can do the game. Finish the game. Same thing. Anyway, so yeah, I'm going to leave it there for today. So thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like button, add the video to your favorites, or share it on Facebook and Twitter. Any of that stuff helps me out a lot, and I'd appreciate it if you could do so. And uh, as well, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. There will be more SCP. Uh, I also play other horror games, indie games, Minecraft, loads of random stuff like that. Um, so yeah, if any of that interests you, then please subscribe. And again, thank you so much for watching. As always, I'll see you in the next video, and goodbye.